hairdresser revealed that Meghan was rejected by Boots, as she insisted that Harry use fake spray. GQ magazine's snub of the Duke has ignited a significant royal beauty scandal. Recently, Prince Harry was seen sporting thick dark locks in a promotional headshot for a mental health tech startup. However, just days prior, his fiery colored mane appeared considerably thinner and lighter at a polo match in Singapore. This raises questions. Is Harry aiming for a closer connection to the crown, or is he doing everything possible to maintain his red hair? While some commentators alleged that Harry's promotional photo was digitally altered, experts suggest a less high-tech explanation. Spencer Stevenson, the founder of Specs Hair and a prominent hair loss and transplant advisor, believes that Harry's lush mane is likely achieved through spray on hair used for events and photo shoots, possibly including nanogen hair fibers. This technique, often a closely guarded secret among A-list celebrities, helps many achieve instant hair thickness for photo shoots or films. Spencer also noted that Harry's hair appears to show signs of improvement, appearing darker and thicker recently. A source close to Meghan's hairdresser confirmed that Meghan encouraged Harry to use the fake spray, possibly to emulate a product from Boots, while inciting jealousy toward Prince William. On one hand, the Sussexes aimed to have their brand be the marketing face for Boots, while Harry also aspired to grace the cover of GQ magazine. However, it seems their rebranding plan has not succeeded, with WME staff revealing they haven't received any contracts yet. For now, their primary focus is on participating in the Invictus Games. Harry's preoccupation with his appearance and rivalry with William has garnered criticism. Accepting their differences could have spared him from this scrutiny. His actions have made him the subject of ridicule, contrasting with William's more graceful acceptance of his own boldness. Ultimately, the outcome of William's pattern of boldness is considered more appealing, without the frizzy, faded hair or the unfortunate look from the back that Harry has been associated with. Harry's best course of action might have been to heed the age-old advice. Better to be thought a fool than to open one's mouth and remove all doubt. We invite you to share your thoughts in the comments section, and also don't forget to join our community by subscribing to our channel so as to get all the latest updates. Stay tuned.